Well, here's the interesting story. This time it turns out that there is an apostate uh, Christian, quote-unquote, cathedral, which cathedrals have no basis in Scripture whatsoever. There's no such thing as a cathedral in Scripture, in the New Testament at least. But in this case, you have over in the UK, of course, there's a Muslim art and culture festival being held in a Christian cathedral. So it says here on uh, jihadwash.org, Muslim art and culture festival to be held in Christian, Christian, quote-unquote, cathedral. Uh, Christians continue to do the dirty work for the Islamic, in relation to Islamic art, Manchester Salam Festival, running from July 20th to the 25th, but will take place in the Manchester Cathedral, among other venues. Well, like I said, the sadly today the Church of England has become so apostate that they're building up with the Muslims and all the other um, heathens out there, all the papes, which, again, you know, the Church of England, essentially, it is just a repackaging of Roman Catholicism. So... And of course, Rome is the mom of Islam, which you can see the connection there. But it says here on Jihad Watch, why a cathedral? Good questions, considering that Islamic art is a death sentence for Muslims and non-Muslims alike. Uh, there is a whiff uh, of any uh, depiction or suggestion or of a depiction of Muhammad involved. Yeah, uh, there are over 100 mosques in Manchester. So why the, why the need to use a Christian cathedral as a venue? The, if the festival involves singing from the first Pakistani female Grammy winner. Uh, we, all, we see all too often across the Islamic world that women and men are arrested and beaten for even daring to perform outside of a mosque, let alone within its walls. So perhaps this is where Christianity is useful for, to rogue Muslims in the West, or they can get away with doing things that they would uh, be stoned to death for doing in their own lands. St. Andrew's Church in South Wa South Walk, South Wark, London, uh, is a regular host to the Big Gay Iftar, the traditional Islamic evening meal which celebrates, Ra celebrates Ramadan during the month of pride for gay Muslims. So not just butting up with the Muslims, butting up with the, the filthy sodomites too. You know, gotta love that. But this is how they how apostate the Church of England has become uh, in this day and age. So it really is sad, but like I said, they have not clearly they clearly have not read Genesis 16, verse 11 to 12, which says that Ishmael will be a wild man, but that's just a sad reality we live in today in the uh, Western world. So anyway, don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.